Hey, this is Brian B. So in this video, I'm going to show you how to make an object that you draw more interesting and more eye-catching and a little bit more engaging. Okay, so you can see that this is a house. Hopefully you can tell. And this is, it's kind of boring. I mean, it follows the the standard rules of, you know, 3D dimensions and, you know, it's all nice and legit and straight, right? So the first thing that you can do to it is make the perspective more extreme. So what I mean by this, this is corresponding to this. So it's nice and straight, everything follows the rules, but you can add a extreme perspective to it. So it turns into something like this, which is corresponding to this. Okay, so you can tell it's a little bit more engaging. You can see it and uh, it's more dynamic and you can see that the perspective is a little bit sharpened and it is definitely it, it has that stronger of a, of a contrast between the big and the small so you can see it's zooming in this way right okay so the second thing that you can do is actually add in a little bit of a skew so it turns into something like this now this compared to that you can tell there's a huge difference so what i did with that is um i took this shape and i did uh the skew which is pushing the lines inwards like this, boom, 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 as you can tell from the illustration. And then it creates this nice uh, effect, which is, which you can tell is really, really different from this. And when you see that, it's like, wow, boom, it's a lot more engaging than something that is just normal and it follows the rules. Very different from that. Okay, so to recap, First thing you can do to it is give it or give it an extreme perspective, like so. All right. And the second thing you can do is to skew the lines inwards. And I'm probably going to make more tutorials on how you can do this properly. But by skewing it and uh, giving it the extreme perspective, you get something like this as opposed to this, which is a lot more engaging. I hope you like this video. Make sure to check out my website to get the free urban design crash course program. In this program, you're going to learn three fundamental design skills and a bunch of cool stuff. Alright, so I'll see you there.